Ah, you look gorgeous. Oh. It is so nice to see you in person. I know. It was all on Zoom last time. We were time. Zooming, but I appreciate you doing it back then because we needed uh, we needed to entertain people. Yeah. So thank you so much. Thanks for being here. Oh, it's so great uh, to be here in person. We were, uh, we were talking about Loki yeah. before it came out, yeah. and now it's the most watched uh, Marvel series on Disney+. Plus. So it's, it's, it, I know. it blew up. It blew up. I know. Just got nominated for six Emmys. That's right. Well yeah. deserved. Yeah. <laughs> How cool is that? Yeah. What, yeah. Uh, people love the show. What, what was uh, what was your reaction when you saw it become the biggest thing? Oh, it was so surreal. I mean, the whole experience was amazing, and for me to join something that has, it has such a huge fan base, and obviously Tom Hiddleston's played that character for such a long time. So to be, you know, this morally ambiguous character like R Ravona Renslayer is kind of been really cool for it me. It kind of introduced the multiverse to yeah. the world. Yeah. Do you do you understand the multiverse? <laughs> Does anyone understand the multiverse? I don't know. I'm a little... I think I do. I act like I do, but I, don't test me on it. I know. I kind of feel like we need a tutorial on it. When we first started the first season of Loki, Tom gave us a big Loki presentation, kind of a PowerPoint on, on his character and the Is history. That right? He explained it from, yeah. from Loki himself. Exactly. That's fantastic. From the horse's mouth. But uh, I feel like we need one for the multiverse. Do you, uh, are you filming season two? Yes, we just started. Oh, really? Yeah. Over in London, right? I, That's right, I, yeah. I, 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 yeah. Everything's quiet and under wraps. And, and it is, it is, I'm afraid. I'm not allowed to give too much away. But no. Um, but no, it's really, really great to be back. And it kind of feels like, you know, because my character deals with time and the Time Variance Authority, being back in that world, it's it's like no time has passed. Uh, we talked about your, your paintings last time. Uh, you're an amazing artist. Oh, uh, I think you did, uh, at the time that George Floyd was one, you right. did. Yeah. Uh, and I, you brought a picture of one. You did a portrait of Kevin Hart. Oh, And it yeah. actually looks exactly like Kevin Hart. <laughs> um, <laughs> that's amazing. Why did you... Why did you choose Kevin over other comedians? <laughs> <laughs> um, I mean, oh, yeah. no, you know, I, yours is people, coming, yours is coming. I've been with you through some hard times, COVID. <laughs> Zooming with you during COVID and everything, oh yeah. Gosh. But Kevin gets special treatment. Yeah. Well, I, I tell you, the reason um, I, I chose Kevin, we just um, finished a movie together. Uh, oh. We did a movie called Lift, um, and it's set in the art world. It's kind of like an action heist thriller, and he was constantly sort of teasing me about my painting. You know how Kevin kind of likes to tease. Of course. Um, and and kept that's saying. Why, well, that's why <laughs> we don't have him back on the show. He's banned. <laughs> 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 um, and you know he he was developing an interest in art genuinely during during the sh the show the show itself. Yeah. And um, I actually during filming got COVID. Um, uh, it was luckily a, a mild case, but yeah. I had a bunch of time off work. I'm and um, yeah, so fortunately it wasn't it wasn't too bad. And I got the paints out because I was in isolation again, and so was able to give him um, this this painting of him. Did he did gift. he love it? He loved it. Yeah, he was he was really it was lovely. It was like the last day of filming. And it was kind of emotional. I think you got his eyes perfect because he does have kind of those little puppy dog <laughs> eyes. It almost looks I like know. he's crying sometimes. I, I like, know. Kevin, what's wrong? He's yeah. Like, Nothing's wrong. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> He starts yelling at me, making fun of me, yeah. Uh, uh, your show, Surface, uh, let's talk about this. You star in an executive producer. Yeah. That's a lot of work. Thank you. Uh, congrats <laughs> on this. Um, can you explain, uh, basically, it's, 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 you play a character who's lost her memory? Yeah, and yeah. And then she's trying to get her life back together, really. Yeah, that's right. I play Sophie Ellis, and the whole show is a, a psychological thriller set in San Francisco. And basically, at the beginning of the show, Sophie, we discover, has lost her memory after an accident. And, um, and she sort of is trying to put the pieces back of her life together and she discovers that um, her husband maybe she can't trust and uh, the whole there's so many twists and turns but there's a sort of did she jump or was she pushed element to this accident and uh, we sort of get sucked into her life and and you know the glamorous world of San Francisco it's really interesting uh, I want to show everyone a clip right here yes. here's a uh, Google and Batara in surface take a look Sir, which way are you taking us? Uh, you need to get out of this lane. This is the best way. No, 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 you don't understand. This way goes over the bridge. I can't go over the water. Just, just pull over, please. Let me out. What are you doing? Let me out of the car! All right. All right. 
Speaking of water, there's a really good underwater scene, which is yeah. tough to do underwater acting. Yeah, I, I mean, I've watched movies and TV shows with underwater scenes my whole life, but I've never done one. And I have to say, it was kind of a real challenge. <laughs> I have to jump into this, you know, big tank, and every single time I jump, and I just couldn't help but sort of screw my face up. And the director was like, "You're screwing your face up. You're like, you know, making this weird face." And I'd be like, "No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I'm just holding my breath, trying to stay That's alive." What someone would do if they right? go underwater. Right. Yeah. And, and he's no. like, "No." No, you're screwing you're your face actor. up. Watch this, watch the playback. And every time I was just like, mm. um, and they were <laughs> slowing it down. And, and so it was kind of really bad, but it's like you're, you're, in your, you're not in your natural element, you know, and yeah. your face does such different things. So, so now you know how to underwater act. Exactly. There you go. <laughs> Gugu and Batara, everybody, surface premieres globally July 29th on Apple TV+. Plus. We'll be right back with stand-up from Pete Lee. Stick around, everybody. Come on back. Hey, hey.